and welcome to this Petsys Therapy tutorial video. Today we're going to be showing you how to sign in to the Petsys Therapy safeguarding training course that we've set up for you. Now the first step will be you'll be invited to this uh, training course in a personalised email. So here you can see the one I've received is addressed to me. There's then two paragraphs that outline why we're doing this course and what it aims to help you with. And crucially, there are six steps here that we're going to be working through in this video. Uh, so the first step is to click on a link uh, to access the sign in page. On that page, you will then uh, click on to request password. Uh, you need to set this password before you then sign in. You'll be asked to enter your email address and click send so that the system will then send you a password to reset that email. Once received, please click on the link, enter your password, confirm it, and then save. You'll then be taken to the sign on screen. Now you'll need to enter your username. So the email that you'll receive will actually have your username within it. So here you can see my one is capital P A T hyphen and then a number. Now this is my PAT ID number. Your one will obviously be different. You can find that on your Indate ID badge or more easily, you can find it in the email that has been sent to you. So when you receive the email, it's probably a good idea to just make a note of this entire username here so that you don't have to find it at a later, later time in the process. Once signed in, you'll then be on a page titled My Courses. Click Safeguarding Essentials to launch the course. Now I'd like to just point out, we've got a paragraph here that essentially outlines how long the course takes. It's roughly one and a half hours to complete and it begins with three content sections. While you work through these sections, you can take a break at any time. You can go back to the course and resume where you left off. The final section of the course, the fourth section, is a short test. You need to allocate at least 10 minutes to do this. Once you have started, please work through to the end. If you leave partway through, you will be re-required re to restart the test from the beginning. Then on successfully completing the course and passing, you can download your personal certificate. Now, of course, if there are any queries uh, or you experience any problems, please don't hesitate to contact us. The best way is either by emailing reception at petsastherapy.org or by calling one of the office team on 01865 671 440. So the first step is we're going to click this link to take us to the access sign in page. And it's taken us to the uh, sign in page. Now, remember, I said um, we first of all need to request a password. So you don't enter anything here in registered users. We need to request this password. At this point, you then need to enter an email to receive that uh, email address from the course provider. So I'm entering my email and then I hit the send button. And it now tells me that they've sent an email to the email address that I've put in. So we can now come away from this page to check for that email. Okay, so I've now opened up the uh, email that was sent to me having clicked on that reset password link. And this is the email that you will then get. Uh, it will say, hello, someone, hopefully you, has requested a password reset for the following e-learning account. There is your username, which is your PAT ID. And to change the password for this account, we, you need to use the following link. And you need to use this within 24 hours because otherwise it will no longer be valid. So we're going to click on that link as requested. And it's here asking us now to enter a new password. And it needs to be at least eight characters. So I'm going to enter a password that I can remember. Uh, 
and I'm going to hit save. And as long as those two passwords match that you've entered, uh, it will allow us to move on. Here we go, it's saying your password has been saved. Hit OK. Now we can enter our username, which is the PAT ID. So PAT in capitals, hyphen, and then whatever your individual PAT ID number is. This is my one. And the password you've just selected in the previous step. Once you've entered those, hit sign in. And here it takes us to the dashboard uh, on the Illumos site. And here you can see there's an option for safeguarding. If we select that, underneath is the actual course called Safeguarding Essentials. Now, when I select this, it's going to take us to the home page of the course, and uh, I will talk you through the next options. So here we can see that the uh, course page is now loading. And the first page that you see is the welcome page, which is branded with Petsys Therapy. It tells you the name of the course, Safeguarding Essentials, and this shows you that it is a certified CPD course. Now the next step is to select this button here called Start Course. And this will take you to one of the first steps in setting up uh, your individual course. So here we're on the dashboard. Um, this shows you the three different sections that we're going to work through. The first step is safeguarding our future. The second step is how you can help. And the third step is what would you do? Now, as I said uh, earlier, these can be worked through at your leisure. You can leave at any time and it will remember your um, place in, in those uh, sections. However, once you've completed them, the fourth step is the test. Here it's greyed out because we can't start that until we've worked through these first three sections here. Once you do start this test, it is really important to note that you must complete it in one go if you were to leave partway through, you would have to start that test again. You need to allow at least 10 minutes to work through that test. Once you've successfully completed that, uh, you will then be able to download your personal course completion certificate for your own records. And that is the end of the actual course. Now, there's something else I'd like to point out up here, which is this spanner icon. This is the settings for the course. So if we select that, you've got areas here so you can ask the expert, there's a glossary, any resources that might support the course summary. But here are four options that may make viewing and interacting with the course easier for you, depending on your um, vision and depending on your hearing. So we have audio descriptions. Currently, that's selected as on. You can simply toggle it on or off. Uh, you can turn subtitles on or off. You can outline buttons just to make it easier to see where the buttons are. And also you can inverse the colour scheme on it, uh, again, making the page easier to see in certain situations. So I hope you found this uh, useful. Um, but as I've said, if there are any further questions or queries that you have, please do reach out to us at head office on reception at petsastherapy.org or by calling the office number 01865 671 440. Many thanks for watching and best of luck.